Howdy y'all. My name's Dale Verts. I'm a wannabe bass fisherman. That's about as good as it gets anymore. Be right back. I have a theme to this, especially for you new folks. So I'd planned on doing a different video today, actually yesterday, and I saw Randy did another little thing about me on his channel. I appreciate that. Um, Randy and I are not friends. We fished around each other years ago. He barely remembers me, which is fine, mostly. <laughs> Thought I'd tell you guys, I've gained like 40 subscribers since yesterday, which is cool. I don't do this for subscribers. I do this because I love bass fishing. It's been a passion of mine for a lot of years. Um, so I thought I'd talk a little bit about myself because man, I just love to talk about myself. Not, not really. Um, I've been bass fishing for 47 years. Started when I was in junior high. Ate up about it. Did it for a living, technically, for several years. I guided. Had some good tournament success back in the day and just I go on and on about my lack of prowess with being a tournament fisher. Most I just look because I was too poor. I fell on it. I don't care. Um, but my channel is not about tournament bass fishing, although I fish some tournaments. I fish tournaments during the week because I work weekends in my own little business, and uh, I'm doing a horrible job at it. 60 years old. Hard to believe I'm 60. Been married almost 32 years to the same gal. She's not very bright. Have twin daughters will be 23 next week. I have a son will be 26 next month. I own a little restaurant here in Central Missouri, in the woods. Horrible to fish. We have a lot of happy people coming in. It's a hard way to make a living. My job in life. Are you ready for this? Is this going to show you something about me? I'm a dishwasher. Yeah, I'm maintenance technician, janitorial custodian, whatever. But I'm also the guy that washes dishes by hand. No big dishwasher. That's what I've done for nine and a half years. I have no ego. Matter of fact, my ego got plucked, shucked, and thrown away years ago as a tournament bass fisherman because I found how quick you can be nullified in the world of fishing when you're a tournament fisherman. And a guide to a degree, too. If you're going to watch my videos, you're going to realize it ain't professional. I ain't professional. I don't care. I'll say I don't care a lot. I care about things that I can fix, things that need to be addressed but mostly i don't care about stuff i don't let stuff get to me i don't do politics well i, I hate i hate drama and the worst thing is my youtube videos where i do a <clears throat> and i don't do clickbait very well either where i do one about forward facing sonar or something that's one that gets the most views i'm like randy i can show you the most important thing about fishing in the world and nobody watches it which is fine i'm not the one to share that i do very few fishing tips I give away a few things I hadn't seen other people do. I've been pretty unique in some things. I'm a unique person for sure. We have chickens in the background. We live in the woods. I have a perfect life that way. But I hate technology. I hate these things right here. I don't own a cell phone. It's not some statement. It's just where it is. I see people abusing cell phones. to see my restaurant people on the phone all the time. I ought to have one just for a phone, but I hate the idea of paying for something that I don't like. I already do that. I pay the government every three months for something I don't like. I've been a bass fisherman since 1977. Long time. Decided early on I wanted to be a professional fisherman. Inspired by guys like Chris Conn. I grew up around Steve Hood. He ended up being a friend of mine, a hero or mentor. I talk about him. I tell stories about him sometimes. Shut up, chicken! If they didn't give me eggs, I wouldn't have nothing to do with them. What is wrong with that chicken? You see guys complaining about aeroplanes and jackhammers and road graders. I have to worry about chickens and stuff in my videos. Guys, I'm plain. I don't have an act. I don't have an agenda. Except my anti-technology. I do not like forward facing sonar. I never will. I refuse to accept that. Gear trail cameras, all that crap, I hate it in the outdoors because my passion is the outdoors. I'm also a sometime hunter. I don't, man, it's horrible how I don't have time for that. I'm a trapper. Uh, if you don't like that, too bad. If you don't like me, 
too bad. I don't do this for money. My channel is monetizable, but I do not collect money from this. I've never monetized. I have another channel, Hit Billy Outdoors, was technically not my first channel, but my first big channel. I get paid a little bit of something for it every month. I don't try, I mean, well, I haven't done a video on it in a month. How's that for stupid? I tournament fish some tournaments. I fished one two days ago. Did horrible as usual. I can't get a grasp of my fishing. I did not fish tournaments for over 20 years. A few piddling ones here and there. Starting in 2018, I started fishing a couple with my buddies. But on my own last year, year and a half ago, and I have done horrible since I came back. I cannot get my mind wrapped around what I'm either doing wrong. I'm doing very little right, and it bothers me. But I tournament fish to be the best fisherman I can be, not to be a professional tournament fisherman again. In fact, the boat I'm sitting in now is 25 years old. <laughs> My tow vehicle, 25 years old. Actually, I sold boats for almost 20 years of my life, and I sold this boat brand new in the spring of 1999, and I was glad to get it back. I love these old Tidecraft boats. Sold boats, guided fish tournaments for 20 years, almost overlapping because selling boats was a way to be inside on the tournament fishing, got sponsors and things that way. But my life is not tournament fishing, but I do think about it a lot because I want to be a better bass fisherman at 60 years old, and it's not been working very well. Randy said over 50, you lose your stuff. I saw that several years ago. I said, oh boy, well... Whatever's happening, it ain't the technology that's beating me. I'm beating myself. I weighed in one keeper Thursday. Now, it's a tough tournament. A lot of boats didn't weigh in nothing. But one keeper. And it hurts. And I'm still trying. I'm not going to give up yet. A year and a half isn't very long. But I have not done a very good job. But you'll see me fish out of a kayak. You'll see me fish on the bank. I don't care. I weigh the creek. Whatever. I like to catch bass. I need to go somewhere and catch some smallmouth. I haven't been smallmouth fishing except a float trip on the river a couple times since I came back to fishing. I love catching them brown bass. I just love fishing, and that's that's all you need to know about me. I'll share some stuff. I have things I still have not seen YouTube videos done on, but I'm not a great peruser of YouTube videos because most of these bass fishing YouTube videos are bunk. Randy says, that I man, that's not me being, yeah, I'm being judgmental. Sure I am. The only thing I have... Promo-wise, I have a partnership with Gary Nasty and Solar Bat Sunglasses. Tremendous glasses. Gary saw my video I did about Geet Hibden uh, this spring, and, uh, had any, and then a video I did about Solar Bat Sunglasses, my review of them. Huge believer in them. That's the only commercial you'll see this time on that. They are having a sale through the end of October. Check out the link in the description if you want good glasses. Not necessarily high-performance RB2 or 3 sunglasses, but they have other stuff too. Good people. I don't know, I, I, I should have wrote a script for this, maybe. I talk about how great I am. <laughs> I'm horrible. I don't have an ego. I'm just documenting the things I do. I have not been documenting tournament fishing like I thought I would because I ain't catching, it's boring. But I had people like my way of thinking, the way I approach things. Uh, my next tournament's in two weeks. I'm going to start, and it's not where I want to go. Uh, it's Lake of the Ozarks, Lower Lake, Clearwater. The Lyoscope guys are going to put the whammy on me. I get that. I'm going to go try anyway because it's not them I'm fishing against. I'm fishing against myself and the fish. I'm beating myself and the fish are beating me. And that's the way fishing is wherever you go. Whether you're tournament fishing or just fishing a pond for fun, you got to get over yourself first and then you get over the fish. There you go. I thought I'd try to explain a little bit about myself, my congestion from some sort of allergy. I think maybe Randy gave me that. I never used to have those problems. I'm 60 years old, a lot of things I didn't used to have. Thought I'd share this with y'all. If you're new on board, appreciate it. If you've been sticking with me for the last couple years. I actually did my first fishing video. My first YouTube video was 2017 with a fishing video with my daughter. I didn't know about this money stuff. I'm simple, and I admit it. I'm not proud of it, maybe, but I, whatever. I'm going to go do some work, because that's what I do. Thank you guys for watching. God bless. See you down the road. Maybe with some fishing stuff.